<sighs> okay. It's early in the morning. And I think you and I need to have a little chat. I'm going to step on you right now. And I don't want to hear any judgment. I don't want to hear any lip. And we're going to do this respectfully. You understand? You're making me feel a little anxious, a little nervous. You know, and I just don't need that type of crap in my life right now. I know I said I loved you last week, but I don't think I'm feeling the love right now. And I don't know what to do about that. I think I need to assess our relationship. So what do you think we should do about this? Happy Thursday, my fabbies. Okay, so gained a pound. Gained a pound. And you know, one of the things I need to start assessing is do I want to continue with weigh in Thursday every week? I don't know. I don't know. I'm starting to get anxious about it because again I'm a woman of a certain age things aren't happening as fast as they they were things are happening faster than I want them to happen oh, it's a complete oxymoron oh I'm gonna sneeze so I don't want to fall in to that trap of being overly anxious of weigh-in time because I'm not screwing up I'm, I'm I'm well there was that bagel that I ate but a bagel's not gonna screw me up all the time is it I mean I'm confessing my sin here I did have a bagel but a pound really no <sighs> something that I thought had gone away did not go away and for us women of our certain age we know what that is I know myself and I know in the past that I would start getting obsessed with that scale. I would step on it in the morning. I would step on it in the middle of the day. I would step on it at night. I would get up in the middle of the night and I would step on it. And I feel like that's coming back in my brain. And I don't want to. This is not... quick fix. This is a lifestyle change. And you know what? I don't got that kind of time to be stepping on the scale every four to five minutes. Who does that? I know, okay, I've done it, but I'm not doing it anymore. So it's time to assess my stepping on the scale routine. Do any of you guys feel like you can get obsessed with the scale. I don't think I'm the only one out here like that, right? Why do we do that to ourselves? Oh, I'm such an idiot. This is what I'm thinking of doing. I'm thinking that I'm not going to be doing weigh in Thursday every week. I'm going to try to do it now every other week. So that'll give me a nice two week period because I still want to be able to, um, you know, track my progress with that. And I do believe that stepping on that scale every week or every two weeks is, is accountability for me um, because that's what I do. I need to talk about this every Thursday and it keeps me going. It keeps me motivated and it keeps me on track big change here on my channel 
we are not going to be weighing in, I'm not going to be weighing in every week. So I'm going to do it every other week. And then on the weeks that we are not, or I am not, stepping on the scale. That doesn't mean you guys can't because I still love hearing from you about your ups, your downs, things like that because it's just the nature of the beast. But on the weeks that I'm not, I'm just going to be talking about how I'm doing for that week. How, I'm, how did I deal with food? Did I struggle? Did I do this? So it'd be kind of a, we'll have a weigh-in Thursday and then we'll have a talk about it Thursday. Or does that sound stupid? Maybe that's dumb. I don't know. Do you guys have any ideas? Let me know because I don't want to step on the scale every week anymore. I just don't because I don't want to go. I'm crazy enough, right? I don't need to be any crazier. At least that's, you know, let's protect my husband's sanity, shall we? He doesn't have much left. So I think I'm going to give that, I'm going to give that a shot. I'm going to not weigh in next Thursday, but we'll still come in and we'll have a little chit chat. Um, I've got a big weekend this weekend, <laughs> girls weekend to celebrate my, my, uh, birthday. Um, you know, I actually was born on leap year, so I'm not as old as you think I am. I'm not even a teenager yet. Now on Monday, hopefully I'll have time to do some editing of uh, what we shot uh, going to the big city. Yes, I got, we're two hicks, me and my BFF, Dutt Fog, are going to the big city. I don't know why I just went into a southern accent. And hopefully I'll be able to show some of the craziness uh, that happened this weekend and let's just pray to Jesus that we don't get arrested because we are going to Salt Lake and they have different rules there. I think, I don't know. So here's to making it back safe. So, okay guys. So thank you so much for stopping by and it's Thursday and I'm taking tomorrow off. So I'm going to have a super long weekend. I'm so excited about it. And if you guys have any suggestions for what you would like me to do on Thursdays that I don't weigh in, just comment below. And if you are liking these videos, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to follow my Hot Mess Express journey on Instagram, I'm holy crap, I'm fat. So you guys, I love you all. You are all my fabbies. So have a great weekend. Take care of yourself. Be safe. Make good choices, and we'll see you on Monday.